Hello runners. Hope you're having a great day today. Here is the second workout for this week. Um, first of all, I just want to say thanks for uh, putting forth the effort and maintaining the running and getting out there and uh, staying healthy. There's no coronavirus out here, so let's go for a run. The weather is great. The sun is shining today. It's crisp, but it's a great day for a run. Make sure you dress accordingly. Got, got to have your base layer. Maybe even a hat. You can always tear that off if you get too hot while you're running. Um, just remember how healthy running is and it's going to build your immune system and it's going to make you stay healthy through this whole thing. So remember to dress right, run safe. Well, first of all, I want to apologize for yesterday's video. I forgot all about the strides. So I want to, I made a new uh, board. I want to show you guys the uh, stretches and the strides. I don't know if you can see that very well. good there they all are you can see that okay so remember every day uh, start and end your run with the stretches and make sure you do your strides as well those are also very important today is Tuesday so that means it's uh, let's uh, stretch band day remember to keep the uh, stretch band uh, around your ankles and uh, I made another board here this is the, uh, the stretch brand routine for those of you that may have uh, forgot about that there you go Oops, shadows are getting in the way over there okay I'm gonna back up a little bit remember to keep it tight remember to keep it tight um, okay so that gets us to the workout for today today you guys I want you to go on a tempo run and I know it's a, nobody really knows what a tempo run is. Um, but the best bet I can think of is um, while you're out there running, you're going to change pace. And it's going to be a multi-paced kind of a run where you're not going to always stay at the same pace the whole time. Um, for short portions of that run, you're going to increase your tempo. So, Tuesday, March 17th. Happy St. Patty's Day. It's a tempo run. And I put times three on there. Uh, the reason I put time three is um, at, I want you to go on a three, three mile run, but somewhere in the middle of that three miles, I want you to change pace and increase your tempo and see if you can hold it. Um, varsity runners, try and hold it for a minute. Go, go hard for one minute and then back off and do that three times. Um, developing runners, JV runners, while you're out there on that three mile run, just start up a new tempo and hold it if you can hold it for 15 seconds or 30 seconds great if you can hold it for a whole minute that's even better and then go back to your other pace and then recover so you're going to go out and you're going to maybe start off a good mile as a warm-up and then start your change of tempos let yourself fully recover before you start the second one when you get back stretch go through the stretching routine again and then go out after you stretch go out for one more mile cool down so for everybody it'll be around four miles i know there might be some people that are um shaving a little bit here or there adding a little bit here or there but it's a tempo run today times three and you're going to end up doing around four miles if you do that extra mile cool down after you finish and you get back and you stretch again i think you're going to feel terrific and it's a great day like i said to get out and run so let's go t-dub